Rip Rip Rob Mob, what is going on? It's Polish Rob, it's Charmeleon, and today we are doing another Hidden Fates opening in search of that ever so elusive Shining Charizard. Guys, I went to GameStop to go look around, see what they had to offer, and I found this great collection box that I knew I just had to buy, especially when they told me that it was 20% off all Pokemon related items. It was a no brainer, so we picked it up because you know what card we're looking for. And this, I think, might get us that much closer to going ahead and picking it up. If we have time today, which we probably will, I'm also going to open up this Hidden Fates tin. Um, I already took the booster packs out of it, so they're ready to ramba. Um, so we'll be opening that too, just to see if we can go ahead and get something good out of that as well. Um, but, this weekend, I... Well, not this weekend. Actually, a couple days ago... It was uh, my girlfriend's birthday, so for her birthday, of course, we opened Pokemon cards because what not thing better to do than opening up Pokemon cards for her birthday. So we opened up the cards for her birthday from Unbroken Bonds, and we ended up getting a few code cards, so I wanted to go ahead and share with that with you guys. And after I'm done sharing these code cards, I am going to show you what two pools that we got that are completely amazing. We freaked out when we got them, um, especially since one of them happens to be uh, a fairy type, which we all know is going to be gone when the Sword and Shield comes out officially in February. So just to get that fairy type was super special um, since they are going to be gone from here on out. So I wanted to go ahead and share, you, share that with you guys before we went ahead and opened up. Uh, these Hidden Fates booster packs. So, those are the code cards. Here's the first card that we pulled. Great card. Let me go ahead and show you guys. It is the Gardevoir and Sylveon Hyper Rare Tag Team. It is such a nice card. Such a great fairy card. And it sucks that we're going to go ahead and miss out on these from here on out. But, it is here. We pulled it. And it was a super great moment to go ahead and get something like this. On top of that, we also got this, the Denny GX Ultra Rare. Super good card from this set. I think it's like the sixth or seventh best card that you can get uh, from this set, aside from the Full R and the Hyper Rare. Um, great card. We freaked out when we got it, so I wanted to go ahead, and go ahead and share that with you guys, the Rob Mob, because you guys deserve to see what we pulled. All right, so let's go ahead and get after this. Hidden Fates Booster Box. Booster Box, what am I talking about? Meant to say Great Ball Collection. Why would we get confused? I have no idea. You know, I don't know if there's a better way to open this, so I'm just gonna freaking rip into it. Make a mess like I always do. Because that's just how we do it. On this channel. <laughs> All right, well. That was, oh God, now Charmeleon's just run away. Now it's just a huge mess over here. Everything is just out of whack, but it's okay. We are going to recover ever so slowly as you guys watch me panic and pick everything up because these booster packs are not trash. Not trash at all. All right, so in this set, you can find, let's go ahead and put Charmeleon back into focus because when everything went tumbling apparently he just wanted to go ahead and take off like a rocket all right so we got the great ball that comes with it great little storage inside go ahead and fit your cards in there uh, nice little decoration that you can get by purchasing the great ball set from hidden fates so there's that super nice can't wait to go ahead and put that on my shelving that will appear eventually in the background also comes with, let's get that turned around, this Zorark shiny card that of course is going to give me the most difficult time in the world to take out, but that's okay. There's the code card for you guys. And we got the Zorark GX shiny. So every single great ball set does come with a Zorark, but it is still a cool card to buy with the set. So why not get it if they offer it? And you also get with that 
10 Hidden Fates Booster Packs. So super exciting, and let's not waste any time at all and start grabbing these packs and opening them up. And Charmeleon is just trying to be an acrobat and go along some different ways. We'll let him just do his thing. If he gets a little bit out of whack, I'll have to put him back on his piece of wood. All right, so for the first one, we got the Charizard Booster Pack. So let's go ahead and start opening up these. Code card. Flip it. And we got a Lieutenant Surge, Misty's Determination, Pokemon Center Lady, Slowpoke, Voltorb, Pikachu, Ekans, Coughing, Coughing, Reverse Hollow, and the rare is a Kangaskhan, non-holographic to start. So we got a Kangaskhan, non-holographic to start, that's okay, we got plenty more packs to go. This one has the birds on it. Go ahead and get her open. Right. Code card. Three card flip. And we are starting off with a Mister Misty's Determination. Jinx. Pokemon Center Lady. Magikarp. Ekans. Voltorb. Geodude. Pikachu. Verse Hollow is a Zapdos. And the rare is... A Brox Training Holographic, and it was so exciting that I dropped it. So, Brox Training Holographic is the rare hollow in that. Guys, if you haven't already, if you're new to this channel, please hit that subscribe button. Uh, please follow, please like, please share. All the uh, all of you guys help out this channel. I hope everything is good. Hope you guys are enjoying as we pull some more great cards out of this set haven't yet but I have a feeling that we're gonna get there get something good Magikarp star you there it is a poi pole shiny holographic so we got a good pull finally a third pack of tough first give and the Snorlax is the rare hollow took us a third pack but nonetheless it is a shiny card that we do not have so it's a poi pole shiny holographic so good pull there from that there you go, Charmeleon went ahead and got back into his position. <laughs> He's not way off camera like he was originally. All right, let's get something good. Ha! No, we can get it. I meant to say hollow, but it was actually a code card. I don't know where the confusion was. My brain was just not working properly. Cliff Aaron, side up, Magikarp, star you. Magikarp again, a reverse hollow and a holographic Vaporeon. All right, and I don't know why I'm putting those. Those are my rares. So we did get one shiny card. We kind of went dead after that one, but we still have more booster packs to pull. So don't you worry. I'm not worried. And let's keep on trucking and keep on pulling. We got Kogastrap, Brock Script. Misty, Caterpie, Paras, Ekans, Saida, Staryu, Charmander, Reverse Hollow, and the rare is, hey, Moltres, Zapdos, and Articuno, uh, Ultra Rare, not the full art, Ultra Rare. So, so far a good pull. I think this is actually the third time that I did pull this card, but either way, it is an Ultra Rare. It is the Birds, so still nice card to get in general. So we got the Birds. So still got a good pull. More packs to go. Let's put those in the camera there. And keep this moving. Guys, make sure you let me know in the comments below what your favorite card is from Hidden Fates. I know most of y'all are going to say that Shining Charger, but there's other great artwork in the pack as well. So everybody has their own card that they like. So let me know in the comments below what you guys like best from this set in general. Hey, there it is, Quacksire, shiny, holographic. So we got another shiny card out of the set, but wait, there still is a rare, which is a Snorlax. Non-holographic, Snorlax nonetheless, though we do like that Pokemon a lot on this channel. Snorlax is a big favorite. So we got a shiny Quacksire. So the shiny cards are coming, as expected. 
Got a few more packs to go. Code card. I don't know why I put the code card on there so long. I'm gonna just shorten it up a little bit. Koga, Lieutenant, Cubone, Jigglypuff. I'm getting out of whack in the camera because I'm getting excited to get to the potential shiny card, which it wasn't because it's a reverse hollow bill. And the rare is Blaine's Last Stand, non holographic. That's all right, Charmeleon, where do you think you are going? Why don't you get back in the camera? Everybody wants to see your face. And you, you know, he's probably disappointed with the pulls. We got shiny cards though, dude. What are you doing? We got shinies. Why don't you hang out? There's more to go. Ah, he's disappointed. He is disappointed. He wants that shiny Charizard just as much as I do. And he is just trying to go ahead and trail off from the desk. We will get, there it is, Energy Holographic, and the rare is a Mr. Mime, non-holographic. So let's try to go ahead and get him back on the camera. There you go, dude. Oh, God, he's on a mission today. I guess this is the wreckage episode where we are just going to go ahead and wreck everything that I have set up over here. That's all right. Nothing is scripted. Everything is figured out on the spot. So the way the cookie crumbles is the way we are gonna roll. All right, how many packs we got left here? We got five more packs of hidden feeds to go. There's the Coke car for you guard, guys. We got the three card flip and Sabrina, Pokemon Center Lady, Metapod, Coughing, Voltorb, Cubone, Geodude, I feel like I get Geodude almost every single pack. A lot of people have let me know, why do you pull so many Geodudes? How many Geodudes do you have? I feel like I should just make a mural and just put Geodudes all over the place because I pull that card so much. <laughs> so, Geodude, Eevee, hey, Gibble, shiny card. That's what I'm talking about. So we got another shiny, not a full art yet, but a shiny nonetheless. I think it's the second one I pulled in my collection, but a shiny card, we'll, we'll always take that. And the rare is an electrode, non-holographic. All right, so we have, this is the fifth, fifth pack out of the five left to go. I think I said that correctly. Math might have been off a little bit. Three card flip. Koga. Brock. Misty. So we're just going to knock out all the, chan or all the uh, uh, gym trainers there. Pikachu, Jigglypuff, Geodude again. I'm telling you guys, this Geodude will just follow me anywhere. I think my first episode, it was a Snorlax, but Geodude ever since. He is my guy, apparently. So we're going to have to get something Geodude related, put him around all over the place, because that is the Pokemon that likes to hang out with me. Rare is a Snorlax. So there, look at there. So we got the Snorlax, the Geodude, the two Pokemon that just follow me the most everywhere it goes. So we're going to have to do something with that. I think I actually have it in my channel page above. The Snorlax hanging out with Charmeleon. But that's that. Four more packs. Let's pull some more shinies. What do you guys think? More shinies is the way to go. Code card. Let's just hit myself in the face. Graveler. Another evolvation of Geodude. Farfetch'd, Jinx, Paris, Ekans, Psyduck, Staryu, Clefairy, Energy, Holographic, Fire, and the rare is, hey, Jesse and James, Full Art Trainer, not a bad card. It is pretty common out of all the trainers, but it is a, it is a Full Art Trainer nonetheless, and a card that we will always gladly take. So we got that. Three more packs to go. Let's see what we can get. We are not gonna give up. I swear I will keep pulling hidden fates until we get that shiny Charizard. We do not give up here. We will keep going strong and we will get the card that we are looking for. Ekans, Caterpie, Paris, Charmander, Clefairy, Brock Scrit is the Reverse Hollow and the Rare is a Kangaskhan, again, non holographic. That is all right. Two more packs to go. And 
let's see what we get from here. Code card. Keep hitting myself in the face, in the shoulder, in the arms. Hit Charmeleon the other day with one. Scyther, Magmar, Charmeleon, there we are. Clefairy, Keybone, Jigglypuff, Eevee, Caterpie, Energy Hollow again, so that is just a common thing from this so far, it's just Energy Hollows, and the rare is a Clefable, non-holographic. Alright, one more pack to go, and let's see what we can get from here. Pull card. Alright, Metapod. Sabrina, Charmeleon again, Clefairy, Cubone, Jigglypuff, Eevee, Caterpie, Vaporeon, Blaine's Last Stand. Vaporeon was the reverse hollow, and Blaine's Last Stand was the rare. So no shiny card on that. Guys, we're not giving up. We are just not going to give up on this. You know what? We are going to open up another Hidden Fates 10 because... I'm determined to show you guys some good pulls. I am not gonna go ahead and give up. So let's just hack into this straight away, not waste any time, and get four more bonus packs from Hidden Fates. Charmeleon is hanging out in the background at a weird angle, but we're not gonna give up. We're gonna keep going. I have faith, why stop there? Let's just keep rolling through the packs. Three card flip. Sabrina Suggestion, Pokemon Center Lady, Scyther, Charmander, Voltorb, Coughing, Ekans, Cubone, another energy card, Hollow, and the rare is another Electrode, non-holographic. Guys, I feel like we are striking out from these collections. We did get a few shiny cards. We did get the birds ultra rare, and we did get a Jesse James full art. But we want more full art shinies. That's what we want. More full art shinies. No, we can do it. Let's not give up and keep barreling through these packs here. Voltor, Geodude, Pikachu, Cubone Reverse Hollow, and the rare is Zapdos non holographic. All right, two more packs. Two more packs to go. Let's not waste any time and open them up. Open them up. If it lets me open it. Why am I talking so high pitch? All right. Go card. I don't know if I got that one in the shot, but I hopefully did. So somebody that's collecting those code cards does not get disappointed at me. Psyduck, Magikarp, First Hollow Slowpoke, and the rare is a Clough Fable, non-holographic. You know, if we were doing the three packs in them out episode, I would just have strikes all over the place over there because we are just completely striking out. Just a few shinies, all those hidden face that we open, it is just insanity. And we are not getting anything else. All right, code card. Three card, and let's flip. Graveler, Farfetch'd, Jinx, Ekans, Psyduck, Staryu, Clefairy, Slowpoke, Verse Hollow is a Graveler, and the rare is Vaporeon Holographic. Guys, we got no shinies out of that tin. What is going on? Everything that I'm picking is just not working out, unfortunately, but this is what we did get so far. Let's go ahead and get these cards in order. We got the Jesse and James full art. We got the Gibble shiny, which was a good card to get. The Quasire shiny. We got Moltres, Zebedus, and Articuno. We got a Poipole shiny as well. And of course the card that came with the Great Ball set, the Zora Arc. You know what? I don't think I'm gonna give up. I don't think I'm gonna give up at all. I'm going to reach back to my hidden chest over here of Pokemon cards. And let's do some more packs. Let's do some more packs. 
I am so flustered that I am dropping in all over the place, but it's okay. Name of the game is getting a good card. So we'll just rip into some cosmic clips, because why not? I know this is a Hidden Fates episode, but now it's an everything episode. You get a piece of every kind of pie in this show, apparently. All right, what do we got? We got uh, Mawile, Dusclops, Larvesta, Stuffle, Rollet, Phantom, Magnemite, Lillipup, Deerling is Reverse Hollow, and the rare is a Beware. Not a holographic. Let's go with Unbroken Bonds on this one. You know, I think we just got all the good pulls the other day when it wasn't on the channel. But it was my girlfriend's birthday. She deserved those pulls, and they were great pulls nonetheless. So, I'm happy with that we did get those, but I'm also trying to show you guys an amazing pull. So, let's keep it rolling. Salandit, Glamyow, Diglett, Charmelina running away, Poliwag, Corballer is the reverse hollow, and the rare is Apura Ugly. Just like these pulls that we are getting. Alright, we got, looks like, three more Cosmic Eclipse booster packs. So, let's keep ripping through. This video is longer than normal, but that's okay because we don't give up here. Make sure you guys hit that like button, subscribe, and tell me how terribly I'm doing on these pulls in this episode. We got a Titanol Island Challenge Amulet, Erica, Eevee, Duskull, Time Pole, Flababy, Alolan Sandshrew, Reverse Hollow's Mars Shadow, and the rare is a Waylord non holographic. Guys, I am so sorry. I feel like the worst person alive because we are not getting anything good. But let's not get flustered. Let's keep pulling. Let's hope we get something good to make up for all this mess that we are making behind me. It's like with the co cards, like 52 card pickup back there. Dart Tricks, Cosmo M, Oddish, Ruffle It, Piplup, Balloon Vulpix, Rock Ruff, Rock Ruff, and Resolve, Heliolisk, and the rare is that was it. A Heliolisk non holographic. One more booster pack to go. Let's see what happens. I feel like I let the Rob Mob down, but have no fear. We will pour more here and we will get something good. I know we will. All right. Go card, three card flip. And we have a Bisharp, Tropius, Mimikyu, who's hiding behind a tree, Tangela, Duskull, Time Pole, Piplup, Reverse Hollow's Magnemite, and the rare is a Golar. Rob Mom, me and Charmeleon hope you like this video. Be sure to hit that like button, be sure to subscribe, and give us a comment below. Let me know how we did. Um, and also, if you want, there's more videos over there, so don't forget to click and watch. And until next time, I'm out.